Hey everyone, today we're going to look at Joe's credit tip of the week. And for this credit tip of the week, we're looking at going over limit on your credit cards or lines of credit. So let's get right into this right now because it's a very interesting topic and it's very misunderstood. Just because you can go over the limit with your credit card or line of credit and that there's a fee associated with that doesn't mean that those are the only impacts that will happen when you go over a limit on a credit card or line of credit. These are the top three things to watch out for that will happen on your account if you go over limit on your credit card or line of credit. First, like I said, there will be a fee charge. Most of the time, the credit card issuer has a fee agreement with you that if you go over the limit, there's a fee of 20, 30, 40, 50, even $100 charged to your account because you gone over limit. And because of that, it puts your account further into over limit, okay? The second thing that will happen is the credit card issuer may even decide to increase the interest rate applied to your account for the next six, 12, or 24 months until you stop going over limit and it may increase your interest rate from that current rate which could be 18.99% or 19.99% by 1%. So watch out for that. Third thing that will happen when you go over limit, and I've seen this happen a lot, is your credit score will take a hit. And when I say that, your credit score will go down. And if you stay over limit, it will start to decrease monthly. And if you watch the credit score on your credit app and you're over limit, you can see actually this happen in real time. So make sure that you do everything you can to not go over a limit on your credit card or line of credit. It's not going to be make or break for that one month you do. You will get the fee. You might have to pay a higher interest for a short term amount of time, but credit score wise, it's really gonna start impacting you when you are over limit for month two, month three, and beyond. So that's Joe's credit tip of the week. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you all next time. If you wanna book an appointment with me to speak with me, you can book an appointment using the link in the video description below, and uh, just pop in the time you want to have a call. We can have a five-minute conversation about your credit score and how I can help you get a mortgage.